again YouTubers so this is my January's favorites and one regret so five favorites and one regret sorry this is a little late going up I am on my last day at my other house of rehabbing it I have to put down the kitchen floors today and I should be done I'm psyched so then I'm gonna put it up so um, some of my favorites are the MAC from the Blonde Brunette Redhead in the Blonde, the MSF. As you can see, it's a light pink, uh, deg 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 I forget how they say it. Degrading? De no. <laughs> that just sounds horrible. It's degrading to you. No, I'm kidding. Um, anyway, this is the Blonde MSF, and I love it. I use it all the time. I think it's a great, great highlight, and it gives you a nice flushed color. Another favorite thing of mine um, that I got kind of by accident, I saw it sitting on the counter and said, what's this color? Oh, I don't have that. And I bought it, um, and you guys have heard me talk about it, is Max Sequin. It is a frost. It's a beautiful, beautiful color. You guys have seen my swatch. It was in my haul video. Um, but it's gorgeous. I absolutely love it. So that is another favorite. Another thing from the Blonde Burnett Redhead collection is the 226. This is that pointed, smaller brush that's similar to kind of, or closest thing to a 224 or a 217. The thing I like about this is because of the point and how small it is, it actually gets into my crease great. Because normally I have a really small eyelid space, so I need something that'll get right in and over there pretty well. So that is great. Um, another thing is my Quite Natural Paint Pot. And Abby is watching, uh, gave me the greatest tip ever. This is amazing. Is I used to use um, a brow wax and a brow pencil or a brow powder and all these different things. This, as you can see from the marks in there, I have been using for my eyebrows. It is a color and a wax together and it stays. All I do is brush my brows. I take, um, where is it here? I actually take a Smashbox brush I have, pointed brush doesn't say what number on it is because it's a double-ended actually. Um, I use this, I fill them in, and then I use the brush over it one more time and it stays all day, never moves. Amazing, best tip ever. Thank you so much, Abby is watching. Um, and my last of my five favorites is the Love Connection Mineralized Eyeshadow Duo. I actually have it on right now on my lid space. Um, and this is just such a pretty color. I have been trying for the longest while to find a dupe for, it's an old Victoria's Secret color called Copper Penny, if you see this. Um, Paradisco is kind of close to it, Mythology is kind of close to it. Um, this is kind of close to it, um, but so far it's really just, I really like the, it's the closest thing that I can find that I like to use. Um, but it's absolutely gorgeous, and if you see the, Oops, it's not opening for me. There we go. The really pretty pinks and everything, and then this really pretty gold tone. Uh, the gold tone is fairly similar to uh, all the glitters. It's probably the closest thing I can think of. So those are my favorites. Now on to my regret. I regret the Rimmel La Lycra Lash Extender. Hate this stuff. Don't like the brush. Don't like the smell of it. Don't like the result. Not much else I can say about it. So that is my January favorites and one regret. Hope you guys enjoyed this. If you want a review on anything I spoke about here, please put a comment below. And don't forget to comment, rate, and subscribe. Thanks so much, guys, and have a great day. Bye.